Okay. Ready? All right. Go. All right. It is uh, Monday, August 22nd, mm -hmm. the first full week of school. And in math class today, we were talking about the four steps of solving a problem. Okay, so the kids have that, and we have a little bit of homework to do. Now, in Math 6, the orange book, those of you who have the orange book at home, you are doing page 27, 3 through 6. Okay, so just a couple of problems for practice tonight. I'll expect that tomorrow in your basket, um, turned in, being a class. Math 7, okay, you guys that are in my fourth period class, you have the blue book, okay? And that homework is on page 28, 3 through Eight. Okay, and the other thing I want to talk about is we're going to have some prizes here. Every once in a while when things are going well and kids do what they're supposed to, we've got some prizes. Donated by Sam, and they are little cards, little stickers, and they're very cool, they're very neat, and they actually have funny little, like instead of, instead of Hawaiian punch, this is Hawaiian pants. You see that? It's kind of a play on words there. And then we have others. Um, oh, instead of Mr. Potato Head, we got Mr. Picasso Head. And then we have, instead of Hawaiian Punch, we have Hawaiian Pants. Yeah, yeah, actually. Okay, Mr. Esposito, what the hell is okay. going on in science? Mr. Esposito, I've what did we do from the today? 80s on. Oh, he's got his 80s jacket. I've got my 80s jacket, ladies and gentlemen, just like that. Isn't that beautiful? And also, this is awesome. Awesome. Dynamite. I even got these for old police cars. Look at this. Like that. How do you uh oh, like that? Is that Frank cool? Poncherello is in the house. Is that all right? Yeah, that's good. Okay. okay. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, moms and dads, what did we do in class today? Well, today was kind of easy. What we did today was we took the South Carolina Mastering the Pact and we did a pretest today. What's a pretest? Oh, Don't pre get nervous because a pretest doesn't count as a grade. A pretest is we want to see how much the students know without any assistance from the teacher without learning anything from Mr. Esposito the whole year, all the standards were going It's a good way to figure out what they know now and what you're going to need to teach them. That's right. right. We do what they know, what they know now, compared to what they will know at the end of the year. So at the end of the year, we'll take the same exact tests out of here, and then we'll compare them to see how much growth there actually was, okay? So some of our students finished this today in class, but I had them take home tonight. They took uh, an assignment called... A scientific summer. What is that? Something we did over the summer or something our parents did over the summer or a family member has done over the summer that is related to science. Mr. Esposito, I didn't do anything. I went over a few examples in class. Hey, did you see a father or your mother or the plumber came over and he fixed the leaking pipe? The leaking pipe? Did you see anybody do any electrical work in the house? How about this? Did you have your heating system fixed, air conditioning system fixed? Did you bake Maybe. a cake? Huh? Did you do any maintenance? Did you bake a cake? Did you bake a pie? Hey, what else? You Did you dinner? boil any water? Did you make a cup of tea? How is that scientific related? Oh, yeah, that would be. Well, what's happening to the particles in the water? It's a liquid. Those particles are moving fast. So fast, they start to... Yeah, they move apart, move apart. It turns into a gas. So just give me one paragraph, what you did that was uh, scientific over the summer, and another short paragraph, how is it related to science? That's good. Now... Other thing, in math, sorry this is coming after the science, if you're still watching and you need to know this, this is good, well you do need to know this, but hopefully you... If you're you, watching okay. this after Mr. Espy has been talking for an hour... You need to talk a lot, but listen, we have a Fantastic Five quiz this Friday, and on Monday we're going to the library to get books for our first nine week book report thing that we're going to be doing. Now the kids are going to know about this, you guys are going to know about this, I'm also going to have it on my website, we're going to talk more about it as it comes up. But Monday, we're going to the library to get our books. And this Friday, we have our Fantastic Five quiz. Excellent. Two, two things that we need to remember. Two thumbs up. Mr. Esposito, Mr. Croft. Right. Yep, and one last little uh, thing. I don't know what this is. Webskins. Yikes. And don't let Mr. Goff take the credit. I'm the one who found all the doubles in these. Yeah, he found all the doubles from all Sam. Right. Sam gave us all the doubles. Okay, thanks. Bye-bye.